I haven't done that and he's dead. Jesus, who did this? That's mad. Jubilant day! I have found your vile self at last! <laughs> Something is having a bit of fun. Can I go two seconds without being put in a sexual scenario? Oh no. I should have done guidance. Am the I dog right? lowers his hackles, his head tilted inquisitively. Convinced that you're harmless, he turns his attention back to the corpse. Can I drink an animal speaking? Around his neck is a collar etched with a name Scratch. With a deep, heartbroken whine, the dog bows his head. Ah. Oh, can we keep him? The dog looks at his owner with sad eyes. He does not move. The dog whimpers nervously, as if to urge you on. <laughs> oh, God. That's so sad. Gone wake, be doubly careful on the way back to Baldur's Gate. I've received more reports of attacks on travelers throughout the region. I counted my best messenger winding up face down in the ditch somewhere. Boom. Happily the little wee. Gail. My condition is worsening again. I need to consume some powerful magic or it may become volatile. You're so fucking needy. Um hang on. I have a ring of flinging. Ah, oh, fine, eat this. I don't really want it. Thank you. Not a problem. It is a strange experience. Each time a new, I come. Kind of lost soul is spelunking through the darkness that is me, only to be sacrificed on the dread altar of the heart. Hey, I have a question. Somehow the second artifact Who hasn't fucking had the asked? effect of the first. Somewhat relieved the discomfort. But I fear my hunger hasn't quite... Uh. What's happening? The magic isn't having the effect it should have. It's not like the last time. Like a rainstorm that quells a forest fire. It merely drizzles. The embers still sizzle. Please, I need to think. I need to retrace my steps to a glade of calm and think. Girl, you're actually so fucking annoying. So where did my ring of flinging go? So it's not it's just not magic. Is that what I'm learning? Blood? Whoa. Hey, look who it is. Okay. Me. Never been better. Oh, that's good. Okay. Oh, fuck me. It's you from the Nautiloid. Please tell me I found you before those so-called paladins of Tear did. Huh? I don't remember you from the ship. Where were you? Now that's a story, and I'll tell it to you. But truth be told, we shouldn't stay here too long. See these paladins of. A great heat roars through you. Her heat, fiery as the hells. Then you're Her lost in visions of demonic armies. As you tear through a landscape of fire and blood. The blood war. You saw it from above as the Nautiloid passed through Avernus. This woman was on the front line. What was that? The tadpole in her heads, it connects us. Fuck's sake. Mountains as far as the eye can see. Guess that explains the voices. From that peak I got into your head, you've made some inroads trying to get the thing sorted. But alas, no joy. No joy indeed. I'm Karlak. And you are... I'm Alistair. Well met, soldier. Now that we're old pals, how would you feel about helping me kill some evil bastards? A little background, <coughs> if your moral compass needs something to point at. You already know I fought in the Blood War. 
I was good at killing demons. Really good. So good, Zariel, the archdevil herself, made me her personal attack dog. Oh. I played along until I could get the fuck out of there. It took me ten years to properly escape, but now I'm free. Zariel sent goon after goon to hunt me down. But believe me when I tell you, I'm not going. The latest yappy little dog she sicked on me are nearby. A group of dopes posing as paladins of tear. Want to help me take them down? You want me to kill the people hunting you? Don't worry. I'll lead the charge. I could use your help. There's a lot of them and only one of me. After that, we can team up. Take Faerun by the short hairs. Sound good? A warrior who winks at her foes while she slays them. You'd be a fool to refuse her. Sorry, my wife. Uh, why should I do your dirty work? Dirty work's the only kind I like. Gets even messier the more bodies you throw at it. Think of the potential. So Lazal doesn't like her, she not? <laughs> okay. Well. Fuck yes. They cornered me outside the toll house just up the hill. Don't they've gone far after the scorching I gave them. Hang on, though. Looks like you've got enough backup at your side. Not sure there's room for me. I'll catch up with you when it's time to camp for now. But don't get to any of the fun stuff without me. Got it? Who do we, uh... Do you know what? I've half a mind telling Gale to fuck off, to be perfectly honest. A trader? Talk to me. Need any supplies? We've fewer mouths to feed now. Ship was. Anyway, <laughs> what happened? The Lord of Justice sent us after a devil haunting this area. We squared off against her. We lost. Talk to Anders if you want the details. I don't have it in me to recount the horror. Yeah. Uh huh. Okay. What's up, Anders? Our scouts told us you'd come. The devil's ally. Come to finish us, have you? The who? That depends. Are you what she says you are? I'm sure she's invented a fascinating history of our crimes. The truth is far simpler. We are paladins of Tyr, Lord of Justice. He sent us after an infernal being, straight out of the Nine Hells, hiding in the form of a one-horned tiefling, Karlak. She slaughtered countless refugees fleeing the Absolute. Yesterday, she butchered an entire family. We were lucky to survive our encounter with her. Say I buy your story, what then? Then you'd be very stupid indeed. <sighs> Poor Karlak. Allied with the first sap she met. Who will be so quickly destroyed. Zariel will find this all terribly funny. I didn't want to fight. Oh. Oh. I don't really want to do this fight. I thought I'd be able to like sneak in and go, yeah, Jesus, that devil out there. That's crazy. So what's your plan? Like, what's the start? <laughs> what can I do you for? Come on. Make room then. Oh, I have to go and tell Gail to fuck off first. Gladly. An ally oh. fresh from the hells themselves. Yeah. Hmm. I need you to see. I question the wisdom of that decision, but so be it. Perhaps maybe I'll be later. here in the meantime. <coughs> idling away the hours. Good lad. Uh, well, have you seen, uh... The Blade of Frontiers at your calling. Has he just not seen? Come on. Let's go, go, go. <laughs> his good eye is on his right-hand side, so he can only see off here towards Gale. Please, no more. Leave us in peace, and we shall leave you in kind. Yeah? Cut the crap, Anders. I know what you are. Don't let her hurt us. Please, we just want to go home. The Archduchess will be delighted when we return with Karlak's head on a pike. You don't fear Karlak, you want to kill her on Zariel's behalf. <laughs> I never was good at playing the coward. There is no beast here or in the hells I fear. Okay. Not with her ladyship's protection. Least of all, this dog. Dog? You do well to reconsider your alliance with this animal. She destroys all she touches. Useful in the blood war, frighteningly dangerous anywhere else. Rage all you want, Karlak. Burn with the might of the hells. Zariel will find you 
She will bring you home in pieces. And your little friends will have to watch. Unless we feed you their eyeballs first. The furnace was never my home. It was my prison. I'm free now. And I'm never going back! On me! For fuck's sake. If there's one thing I know about barbarians, we gotta enter a rage. Oh no, please, this one. That hits all of them, doesn't it? Sick. So I like her. You're the ranged one, so I kinda wanna get rid of you. Still holding concentration? You fucking mad bitch. Wow. Why are we? Take your your And then you don't need to be in here. Why did I walk all the way? I'm not very good at the combat part, I think is I just need to uh No, don't fucking close the door, I wanna walk into it. Great. This is not good. Fourteen. Oh, hey, wait a minute. He's the big problem. Oh fuck! Alistair's the only one who has healing potions. Time for an action surge! Whoa! Right. This is not going too good. Rage. Shit. I thought I had a drinky. Alright, wakey wakey. <laughs> ah! <laughs> yeah, fucking dope. Is she charging in? Is that what we do? Okay, no, hold on, wait, we're doing okay. This might be... Good. Yeah. And then we... Oh, I have nothing to do because I just woke up. <laughs> Where are you going? Okay. Yeah, that's fine. I don't mind that. Uh, ranged attack on this thing. Dead. Good. Miss! God damn it. I guess it's time for Alistair to just save the day, is it? Oh, and now I'm invisible. Fuck them. Yes? Fuck Sauriel. They're dead. I won't go back. I'm never going back. Okay. And if any of Mummy's little friends want to pick up where the others left off, they'll find nothing but a pile of ash. Uh-huh. Easy, Carlac. Flames are getting big. Or do we be friends? Zarya will get near you again. We'll make sure of that. Friends. That's right, she won't. She can't. She couldn't even lay a finger. <laughs> Uh-huh. Stop walking through... What's, um... What are you doing? What's going on? Hey. 
What? Stop! What are you doing? What's going on? Wait a minute, what the fuck? Cadillac, like, there's nobody here! Take it easy! Whew. Had to let off a little steam after facing off with those ignots. Granted, the fire's lasting a little longer than it should. How do I look? Odd. <laughs> Slightly mad, to be honest. You alright? Who? Me? This is the best day I've had in years. Hear um. that? Infernal engine for a heart. Let's me burn as hot as the hells. Seems to be running in overdrive since I left Avernus. Won't be seeing my mechanic anytime soon, so I'll just make the most of the extra heat. Just don't get too close till I found a way to calm it down. Oh, when she said infernal engine, I thought like, like that was a metaphor. <laughs> How the hell did you get that? High pain tolerance and a dynamic duo of truly shitty bosses. But it's a bit early in the game to be getting into tragic backstories. Let's save the scar show for later. After we've worked up an appetite for tragedy. Meanwhile, I'll need to find someone who can tune up my engine sooner rather than later. Believe me when I say this thing is hot. The first time I faced down those paladins, they let slip there was an infernal mechanic in the area. A tiefling. He might be able to stabilize things if I can find him. There's some tieflings holed up in a druid's grove nearby. You might look there. Sounds like a good lead. Hopefully our guy will be among them. A tune-up would do this old tub a world of good. Okay. 